What's up guys, it's Rex here and welcome to another Beyblade Metal Fury unboxing Which is kind of weird to say after all these months, but yeah I'm back with a Beyblade unboxing and today I'll be unboxing Beyblade Metal Fury Hyper Blades uh, Omega Draconis 85XF With Spark Effects Amped Up Colors Yeah Picked this up at Walmart Uh today actually along with uh, Phantom Orion which you guys probably saw my video of oh yeah you already guys uh, if you guys saw that video you guys pretty much know that I'm okay I guess with the boxing my only pop the, the box it comes in don't need problem stop chicken yeah chickens right now uh, sorry um my only problem with it is they already assembled the bay for you come on Hasbro that was like one of my main things about unboxing Beyblades was like actually putting it together when I open the box which is they took that away from me I'm sad but yeah nice packaging or meh packaging and on the back here's the stats which is pretty much all red meaning attack which I'm more or less okay with because I'm more of a balance kind of guy but yeah so let this, let's get this puppy open and see what we got so we got all the contents out of its packaging. Um, it comes with a nice ye lime or just yellowish ripcord, which is I'm gonna probably throw away. Which is okay. I don't really care. Um, it co also comes with a off green, I guess. Um, off green regular Hasbro launcher. Kind of, still kind of sad that there's no light launcher, but I got my string launcher. It's all, it's all good. And lastly, for the tool, it's this nice orange color, which I think I already have an orange tool because I, because I have a lot left over that I don't throw away. Which is nice, a nice spare to have. Uh, I guess it's code time, guys. So for those of you who play. Uh, Beyblade Battles Online, or just, was it Beyblade Online? Something like that. Um, here's your code to unlock Omega Draconis. Here, pause the video. And whoever wrote it down first and entered it, ha now has Omega Draconis 85XF, which is awesome for you, because I don't play it. So, yeah, that kind of sounded mean, Rex. Yeah, but yeah, you guys enjoy the Be uh, Omega Draconis Online. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope you guys kick butt. Because that's how you sp what you're supposed to do. So let's move on to the bay itself. It's skipping instructions because I don't read instructions. Starting off with the face bolt, which is a dragon, uh, a black dragon tattooed, uh, tattooed on a, or printed on a blue face bolt. It looks pretty sick. Um, pretty nice looking yeah there's nothing me to do more I can say there's no spark effects I thought there would be spark effects but I guess since this is a hyper bay they don't really need the, the super sparkly sticker on top of it which is alright with me I'm fine with that moving on to um it's called the energy ring which is a nice jolly rancher green with nice little yellow accents it's kind of like a dragon tail looking thing which is pretty sick looking I can't really tell the half thick there's no spark of sparkly flakes to signify that's heavy or something but look I'm, I'm liking it I'm digging it I'm, I'm feeling it and next up we have the metal wheel which comes in two pieces I forgot how it actually works maybe if we read the instructions to see how it actually works does it tell you oh this isn't the right one that was for Orion excuse me I'm being a extremely unprofessional here let's see so if you have it like how should we have it nope that's the wrong way I'm guessing if we have it like 
this. Oh yeah, yeah. If we have it like this, it should be attack mode, according to the instructions. And when you turn it, not turn it on. Yes, like this. Is this smash attack? Is this smash attack? I think so. It looks like it. And I guess this one is regular attack, which is pretty cool. I love it. I love the 4D base now because you have options. This is pretty cool. Did I say the name of this, which was the Omega Wheel? I think I didn't, but yeah, this is the Omega Wheel. I'm sorry. Being very unprofessional, which pretty cool looking. Um, nothing. No real pattern I can distinguish, like how Orion had no faces or something. It just looks like more like a dragon's back, I guess, which is goes along with the bay. Really cool. Um, so it's pretty much it for now, for this at least. And moving on to the bottom, which I have not taken apart because I forgot to. Ah. Uh, so starting off with the spin track, which is the lowest available spin track you can possibly get, which is the 85 track. It comes in a nice blue color. What shade it is, I don't really know because I'm I'm junk at looking at uh, guessing colors. Nope. Pretty nice. Yeah, the only thing you gotta watch out for it, it just scrapes against the bottom of the stadium, and you lose so much stamp. You, you lose so much power from that. It's, it, that's a trade off you get. Really good attack for really, yes, high risk, high reward kind of tip. So, all right with me. And lastly, we got to the XF tip or the extra fat tip. Uh, again, for another good um, attack bottom or one of the better attack bottoms. I think rubber flat. I think my personal favorite is the rubber flat, but this is a good secondary choice for it. Or metal flat is my favorite. Then rubber, then this. This is a really good. Has more stamina than the other two, which is all right. Also comes in the same blue that the track came in. And I, um, yeah, like I said, it's a really, it's a really good or uh, one of my favorite attack tips. So now that I got everything talked about, let's put this together and see the glory that is Omega Jaconis. So here we have it, folks. The f on a uh, re fully assembled. Omega Draconis and I'm guessing I think this is attack mode it looks pretty cool I like uh, I, I really like the flow of this bay I don't know why it just looks really cool so if you guys see this in Walmart or anywhere else for a lower price just don't hesitate to pick this up and be sure to watch out for the battle vid hopefully that's comes up that's coming out soon but yeah guys that's it for today's vid Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, thank you for stopping by. If you guys have any requests, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, hope you guys have a nice day, nice week, or a nice weekend, whatever it is. And I'll see you guys next time.